guys welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna to be doing a very different video that I've never done on my channel before I had already cleared out my closet a couple weeks ago and I really wanted to clear out my makeup collection because I just am in the mood for getting rid of stuff at the moment and so I was about to start decluttering my makeup collection and I thought to myself I should film this because I was running out of video ideas. So I thought that I would just film my decluttering process because I know that tons of people have done decluttering my makeup collection videos on YouTube. I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you want to see any more, more lifestyle videos like this, anything that's like more simplifying your life, uh, just in general type videos, then make sure to let me know or give this video a thumbs up and let's go ahead and get started. All right, so first I'm going to declutter my foundation drawer. So it's not too overwhelming or anything like that, but there's definitely some stuff that I could get rid of. My concealer area is getting a little filled. A ton of these I don't even use anymore, so it's time to take these babies out. I think I'm gonna just start off with this one first. Actually, I'm gonna start off with these ones. So I use this spray. Sometimes I fill it up with water, so I'm keeping that. This one's empty, so I'm throwing that out. Um, I'm just gonna create like a discard pile and a keeping pile. That still has stuff in it, so I'm keeping that. All of these still have product in it, so I'm keeping that. All right, this is where I'm gonna be getting rid of a ton of stuff. All right, all of this can go. I might use these in the future. Uh, that can go, that can go. I can't remember which one of my Fit Me's still has a lot of products in it. I think it's that one. Whoops. Keeping this, keeping this, and I'll keep this one. All of these. All of these are going. And then I'm pretty much keeping everything in here except for that thing. Keeping all of these. I really only use this foundation. This one doesn't even have a lot left in it. I'm gonna ditch these BB creams because these are literally so old. I know that this one definitely still has some product left in it. Both of these Fit Me's honestly probably need to just go. This one, obviously, you guys can see there's like nothing left in there. Gotta go. These two, I feel like there's still a little bit left in here. So this is everything that I'm gonna be keeping. Fits a lot better, especially the concealers. This is everything in that drawer that I'm gonna be getting rid of. This is my next drawer. This is all of my powder stuff, blush, bronzers, highlighters, and powders. So I'm gonna take everything out of here. I have three acrylic containers in here. So I honestly don't think I'm gonna be getting rid of a ton of stuff in this drawer because this is my weakness. I love blush, bronzer, and highlighter. So just starting with these ones that weren't in containers. Love my MAC blush, love this blush, love this one. I think that this has gotta go, I never used it. This little duo, I think I might keep it because I've only used it once, but I liked it the one time. The bouncy blush has a special place in my heart, so this has gotta go. Most of these powders do, like look at how, there's literally nothing even in there. I have no idea why I hold on to that. And then this one, really has nothing left in there either so I'm gonna get rid of all of those um, these loose face powders still have some stuff in them so I can keep those this is a Revlon like loose face powder or something I've literally never used this so I'm not gonna start today um, this Clinique powder I think I'm gonna get rid of this is a sample from Sephora I think it's time for that to go and this pixie blush I'm gonna keep because that's Dude, I need to clean this really badly. So I'm pretty much going to keep all of these bronzers because I use these regularly. And these are like my favorite ones. But pretty much everything in this section I'm probably going to keep because I use all of this stuff. I'm going to use all of these. I'm taking them out of the container anyway though because I need to clean these. And I'm definitely keeping everything inside of here because I just love these blushes or whatever. But... Um, I don't necessarily think I need to clean this one, so I might just keep everything in here. So that's nice. I'm not getting rid of a ton of stuff, but I am getting rid of these items. 
so this is the status of this drawer at the moment. I'm not crazy about the layout just because there's nothing in this side. There's nothing here. Um, so not sure what I'm going to do about that yet. But I mean, it was nice to clear out some things that I knew I just needed to like trash. So moving on to drawer number three, which is all of my eye stuff. I feel like there's definitely going to be some stuff that I'm getting rid of in here. This looks like such trash, right? But I'm keeping these ones keeping these and then these are some oh I guess I'll keep those ones and these are some in like lashes that I cut up these ones I'm gonna trash just because there's like nothing in there like it's time for these really old uh Revlon ones to go this is like a really pretty elf trio that I had a long time ago but it's like crumbling there I haven't used it in ages time for it to go. This is a really good Estee Lauder quad, but again, I don't use it. Okay, moving on to this section, looking at the tools, um, the tweezers, the scissors, the lash glue, and the eyelash curlers are definitely staying. These two, like, I don't understand why I've kept on to these because they obviously don't curl my lashes anymore. They are like pretty much broken, so I think I'm gonna throw these out. These are just extra tweezers and stuff for lashes, so I think I'll keep those. Um, this is a really cute little Paris thing, but I don't see myself using it, so I'm gonna see if somebody else wants it. I never use this Revlon Shadow. I love this Urban Decay one, so I'm keeping that. I'm gonna keep this Elf one. Just will never use this, and I'm gonna get rid of that. This is like exploded everywhere, so it's, well, no wonder it exploded. This lid isn't even kept on right. Like literally look at how much that is. Like I have no idea why I did not close this properly. I think I'm gonna keep this one. I've never used this, so it's going. I'm gonna keep this Buxom one, get rid of this Sally Girl shadow, and this Makeup Forever one, I don't use, so I'm getting rid of that as well. All of these cream shadows, I love it, so I'm keeping. These are like the Maybelline ones and the Kylie Cosmetic ones. So I feel like the mascaras is where I'm gonna get rid of a lot of stuff. These are really the only two that I'm using at the moment. This one, I have plans of cleaning out the wand and using it for something. Okay, so I'm only keeping this Marc Jacobs one because Marc Jacobs is like my favorite designer and I absolutely adore their makeup packaging, but literally look at how messed up this wand is. I can't even get it out. Oh my gosh. Can we just take a moment, like, what on earth? I'm gonna go through all my eyeliners now. This is crazy. I can already tell that that's trash. That's trash. Um, this Maybelline one might be okay. Oh yeah. Keeping this NYX white eyeliner, that one's like bomb. This is the NYX liquid liner that I use like every day. I'm keeping this Marc Jacobs one because that is such a good pencil liner. I'm gonna keep this Maybelline Eye Studio Gel. The blackest black one because that's really good. Um, this doesn't even have a cap on it, so I'm gonna get rid of that. I'm already keeping one of the Maybelline Master Precise ones, and this one looks a little bit more dried out than the other one, so I'm gonna ditch that. This is an old Kat Von D. This Rimmel liner is actually a really good black liner, so I'm gonna keep that. Anyway, another Kat Von D tattoo liner that is trashed. This is an NYC liquid liner that I think has glitter in it, and it probably still has a ton. Yeah, so that I can keep. This is actually a really good Sony Kashuk brow pencil. This e.l.f. liner, I can't even remember. Okay, so that definitely still has product in it, so I can keep that. This I'm getting rid of. This I'm getting rid of. And God knows what this is. All right, so the next compartment are all these like eyeshadow quads and stuff. All right, so these are a couple little quads of stuff. Um, this shadow, never use. It's going. This Clinique powder, there's nothing in there. Gotta go. This I just hauled recently. This is a glitter by NYX, so I'm for sure keeping that. Um, this is actually a really pretty, um, little quad from L'Oreal, just because I like the gold and the white shade, so I think I'm gonna keep that. Jeez, these are like ancient CoverGirl stuff that I think I picked up from my mom, so I'm getting rid of that that both of these I haven't used ever uh, that's got to go on uh, honestly all of this all of these all of these are going so this drawer I seriously simplified and cut down on I don't even have anything else in that backspace now I have so much more empty space like it's absolutely 
insane. So last but not least, we're gonna be doing the palette drawer. Again, I love myself some palettes. I don't think I'm gonna be getting rid of a lot in this drawer, but we'll see what goes. So like I said, I'd be surprised if I got rid of anything in this drawer because I'm such a palette junkie. I love palettes. So this is an old e.l.f. one that I got a really long time ago, and I think, I think it's time for this one to go. I've, I say that every single time I'm getting rid of a piece of makeup. Like, I think, I think it's time to, to let her go. Yep, not really getting rid of anything in this drawer except for this e.l.f. Color Crush palette because I love my palettes. Even though I only got rid of one thing in this drawer, I reorganized it, cleaned it, so I'm, I'm happy. I feel good about it. So I'm really good about um, going through my lip drawers and stuff, so there's nothing that I wanna get rid of in these drawers at all. I go through my brushes pretty regularly as well, and the only brushes that I'm getting rid of are these two because like obviously like look at, they're like trash. So this is everything that I'm getting rid of. All of this stuff I should've gotten rid of a really long time ago none of it serves any purpose and it looks doesn't even look good at all in my makeup collection so that's pretty much it so I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you enjoyed watching me declutter my makeup collection make sure to let me know if you guys have any questions about this process or other videos that you want to see of me just decluttering things in my life so that's it for this video hope you guys enjoyed I hope you have a fabulous day and I will see you in my next video and when I love and get a feeling something close to like a sugar